Hi, my name is Kevin Callanan. I'm the General Secretary of FORSA, and I just wanted to take a moment to welcome you to this extraordinary FORSA family. You might know that FORSA is the second biggest trade union and by far the biggest public service union in the country. But that's not what makes it so special. What makes FORSA is the people. With over 80,000 members across the country, they've joined FORSA so that they can work together to help each other and to make sure that everyone enjoys working conditions and the respect that they deserve. So I want to introduce you to some of those people so that they can show you how it all works and explain the many opportunities your FORSA involvement can offer you. There are so many interesting and rewarding ways that you can become involved with FORSA. But to understand what those opportunities are, we need to tell you a little about FORSA and how it's structured. FORSA is a huge nationwide organisation, but it actually has a very simple structure, and that the centre is you, the individual member. When you join the union, you become part of your local branch, which is made up of your colleagues, the people working in your area, who understand and appreciate the work you do and the issues and challenges you face. Your branch is your connection to the entire union. And at the heart of every branch are FORSA's workplace representatives. When you are a workplace representative, you are the vital link between your colleagues and your branch. You are the one who connects directly with your branch executive committee, who are just a group of volunteers, just like you, who want to make sure that you and your colleagues can get the support they need as quickly and easily as possible. And your branch is not alone. It connects to other branches in the same sector right across the country. And together, those branches form what we call a division. FORSA has six different divisions in total. Our Civil Service Division represents 30,000 civil servants from all over the country. Our Services and Enterprises Division represents some 7,000 workers across the private sector in aviation, communications and in semi-state organisations, both commercial and non-commercial. Our Health Sector represents over 30,000 people working across all areas of health and social care. Our Education Division represents more than 15,000 education staff all over Ireland. Our Local Government and Local Service Division represent 12,000 members in every local authority in the country. And the Municipal Division, they represent 1,000 of essential outdoor workers in all local authorities and educational institutes. Each of those divisions has its own executive committee, which works in exactly the same way as the branch executive committee, where representatives chosen by the members make sure that each member's voice is heard. And all those divisions then come together to form FORSA Trade Union, which is overseen by one national executive. And, just like our divisions, the national executive is also made up of representatives who have been elected from branches all across the country. And that national executive meets right here in FORSA head office. That's the FORSA family, a nationwide network of branches through which more than 80,000 people work together and support each other. As a workplace representative, you can also be part of a range of consultative councils and professional groups included one dedicated to specific professions. Some people think that unions are all about reacting to conflicts and problems. But the truth is, the most of the workforce does is preventing problems. But that can only happen with people like you. Members in our workplaces who understand the issues facing staff and management and who anticipate problems before they even begin. It's about connectivity, like, you know, because we're spread all over the country in health and we were spread and, and your division were spread all over the country and like we're, we're all going through the same struggle in, in our workplace and if one person has the answer why not share it across the country you know so yeah, we're not just there for fighting or advocating or you know the big campaign we also do have a groundwork and the groundwork does need people to make you know work so I'm very proud of the people that represent you know workers in the movement they're really very upright uh, people um, who do their very best, oftentimes with people in very marginalised uh, positions. I think that's what people need to know is that together you have the power and the strength, you know. Yeah. You know, we're fighting for our rights to be 
kept or enhanced, but at the end of the day, it's going to have to be for our children too, and this is why we're doing this, for them to have a quality of life, work. If you would like to find out more, please contact us at the Forces Skills Academy. We have a range of tailored skills training at introductory, expanded and advanced level for all workplace representatives. Our driving force is investing in knowledge, investing in skills and investing in you.